Hey everyone, welcome. I haven't vlogged in a long time. Just because I didn't really have the time. I don't know. Well, my uh, GoPro mount came off, and then after that, I just got too lazy to reattach it and then do it. it takes a lot of work to keep doing it. I'm surprised, like, all these people that do it do it on a consistent basis. Um, but yeah, uh, I just uploaded a video about our ride uh, on Saw Riders, Muslim group over here. As you can see in there, most of them drive dragsters and cruisers and stuff. I'm the only one on a sports bike with them. But I like sports bikes, so I think I'm gonna be on it for a while. Uh, what else? And uh, I did some updates on my bike. Uh, I didn't have any turn signal so in the back. So I had gotten them when I got the bike. If I ain't got around to wiring it and putting it in, it's pretty easy. It's just too lazy to know where to mount it. So I just mounted it on my plates. And uh, when we went for the ride, one of the guys, he noticed that my chain is uh, like really loose. So I went and got my chain replaced. Well, I bought the chain from uh, Amazon. And my tires were due too, so I just got the tires changed as well. Like, actually, just the rear tire. And one other thing that's left to do on this bike is uh, my brake sensor is not working correctly for the front so when I hit the brakes the lights don't turn on in the back when I hit the rear brakes they work just fine supposedly it's like a common problem with Hondas and stuff so I uh, ordered one from Amazon nine bucks it's like go somewhere here it's supposed to click I just gotta take these bolts off and we're going but uh, I, yeah, I mean I ride it every time I've ridden this already over 2,000 miles since I've had it. So uh, my chain, it came loose. And the reason for that was, uh, I believe this is the reason, I'm not sure. First of all, it's a, it was an old chain. Uh, second of all, uh, it was a rookie mistake. I power washed some of the parts on the bike because they were just ugly, like real lot of gunk on it. Um, and then I forgot to put the uh, chain lube on the chain. So yeah, don't ever power wash your bike. You want to wash your bike, just do it with the sponge, water, soap, bucket, that's it. Uh, do not ever power wash it. Don't even use a garden hose in my opinion. Uh, unless you're just rinsing it. Man, come on, let's go, dude. Can't tolerate people who are in the left lane and driving slow, you know? It's like, dude, you're on the left lane. Drive faster. And if you're gonna drive the same speed limit as the guy on the right lane, Slow down and move in behind them, or speed up and go in front of them. You're not traffic police, so, you know, there's no need for you to keep an eye on the traffic. Like this guy right here, look at this. Old lady though, driving actually slower on the left lane than all the people on the right lane. Tire, lights, had to change this as well, put this on, new chain, rivet chain, yep, oh, also plastic did this uh, panel, cause uh, it just looked bad. Uh, for all those rookies out there as well, uh, if you get a older bike, Keep checking on your 
gasoline because like this is an older bike it doesn't have a gas gauge um, I have not tested like how many miles I get uh, I just started doing that um, and I constantly check the tank one of the times I did not check the tank and uh, I ran out of gas luckily this has a reserve as well like I, I think most bikes do I switched it to reserve and went and uh, got to a gas station which wasn't too far from where I was but uh yeah just keep an eye on that you don't want your gas to run out if you're on the highway or something the way I fill gas on a bike is I open up the tank and I fill it up to I don't know if you guys can see this there's like this little thing right here fill it up to there and then that's how I know it's done just eyeball it and I always put premium.